What's up guys? Welcome back to the channel. Today we're going to go over another helix tone I created. This one was aimed to be a little more low gain. I call it grit. Let's listen to the track. <laughs> If you're into guitars, metal riffage, mixing, and everything in between, hit subscribe and follow along. Alright, so let's go over this tone, but first, let me apologize for being a little bit absent for the last week and a half or so. Uh, things have been a little crazy and hectic here at the house, with everybody home, and um, it's just been kind of tough to get into my recording routine, and it is incredibly difficult to record with everybody home, so apologies for that. But let's go over this tone, shall we? So I was aiming for something with a little less gain on this one, and granted, with the riffs I wrote, it doesn't exactly sound low gain, but for me, it is low gain. The tone kind of inspired that song I wrote. So let's go over the tone. I'm blathering on. So I have the gate on, per usual. And this one's pretty simple. Going into the air apparent, if the gain set to zero, tone set to 8.1, Presence set to 5, the clipping is set to boost, the gain mod is at higher, the level is at 10, and I have the voltage set to 18 volts. Then we're going into the Rev Gen Purple. I've been really loving this amp, no lie, been jamming on it a lot. A lot of good things to say about it. It's given the badunk a run for its money, I'm going to be honest. So the drive I have set to 0.8, the bass is set to 3, the mid is set to 5.5. Treble is set to 6, Presence is set to 2.5, Channel Volume is set to 10, the Master is set to 5, the Resonance is set to 3, the Aggression is at 0, Sag, Hum, Ripple, Bias, and Bias X are all at 5. Now let's move on to the IRs. No surprise here, I'm using an own hammer IR. I'm using the OH412ZLBWV30R121-00. That's the Zilla 4x12 with vintage 30s with the Royer 121 microphone on it, right up against the grill. Now let's move on to the next block, which is a EQ block. It is a low and high shelf. The low gain is negative 2 dB, and the frequency of said low gain is 650 hertz. The high gain is not fucked with at all. And I have the level boosted 3 dB. And then we're going into the room reverb, like I do with a lot of my presets. The decay is 4.5, the pre-delay is 11 milliseconds, low cut 117, high cut 3.7, the mix is up to 20%, a little bit higher than normal, and the level's at zero. And that's it for this tone. Like I said, I was trying to go for something a little more low gain sounding. I don't know that I necessarily achieved it, more than likely it's because of the boost, but I was digging how it sounded, and it inspired me, like I said, to write that track. And I figured I'd share it with you guys. This is also going to be this month's Helix Tone, for those of you that are members of the channel, and subscribers and supporters over on Patreon. So, for you guys, this will be the monthly Helix Patch, so cool. I'm glad I finally was able to get something I was feeling good about, and that I think you'll dig.
all appropriate links down below in the description, including links to my music. And if you dig what I'm putting down, hit subscribe and follow along. So thank you guys for your patience. I hope you're all doing well and everybody's safe and happy and healthy. Thanks to all of you that are supporting me over on Patreon. And of course, all my members here over on YouTube. If you're looking for other ways to support me and the channel, I do have music available at Bandcamp for sale. And of course, streaming on all streaming platforms. And again, thank you guys so much for being here. I hope you enjoyed the video. We'll see you in the next one.